Commercials that never made it to air. Toblerone. For those friends you remember, right at the last second. <laughs> I'm Gaz, this is Lecky, and we're the new hosts of Saturday Night Takeaway! <laughs> Things you wouldn't hear in a medical exam. Yeah, uh, when you're picking up your prescription, do me a favour, deliver this message. Pharmacists stink, doctors rule! <laughs> OK, so the deal is, I don't tell your husband it's not his baby, and you don't tell anyone that when you came in here, I was using my stethoscope to listen to my own butt. <laughs> <laughs> doctor, doctor, I feel like a pair of curtains. Pull yourself together. What? I, I clearly got a mental disorder that's so inconsiderate. A classic's a classic. <laughs> <laughs> It's the stupidest one so far. <laughs> well, I got a pen and I joined together all the moles on your back and it made a picture of me. And I think we're soulmates. Hold me forever. I love you so much. <laughs> Things you wouldn't hear on a news programme. You should be expecting some westerly winds and some rain coming down from the north. And I'm really enjoying stroking this horse. <laughs> and now the news where you are. There's a bear behind you. <laughs> Damn right this is fake news. I'm not even a news reporter. I'm your wife, stood in your living room, holding a picture frame in front of my face and making up facts about ISIS. <laughs> <laughs> Unlikely lines from a children's book. Oh, Grandma, what big ears you have, said Red Riding Hood. Fuck off, said Grandma. <laughs> uh, guys, my dog literally just died. Can we not already happily refer to ourselves as the famous four. <laughs> We're going on a bear hunt. We've already shot Paddington and turned Winnie the Pooh into a fucking rock. <laughs> We're not scared. Things you wouldn't hear on a property show. Bit mean, but we've put together a montage of first-time buyers being told about stamp duty for the first time. <laughs> <laughs> this week, Bert has bought a yurt. And that sentence alone makes this the most fun show we've ever done. <laughs> this house was built on an ancient burial ground, which is why the episode's been hosted by me, the ghost of a hunchback Victorian boy trying to explain fixed-rate mortgages. <laughs> Susan turned her two-bedroom house into a ten-bedroom house by putting a bed in every room. <laughs> Unlikely dating profiles. I like long walks on the beach, a pebble beach, barefoot. I love pain. I love pain! <laughs> <laughs> and would it impress you to know that I typed out this entire profile using my dick? <laughs> <laughs> you could say I'm a bit old-fashioned in that I'm a phenomenal bigot. <laughs>
and have interest in prison reform. <laughs> it's not pick a team, is it? <laughs> do what you want. You sound like a... Do both those. You like science. Yeah. And stars <laughs> and the galaxy. And taking and photos of his arse. And taking photos of my butt. Yeah, I do. I... Yeah. Well, well, I my Instagram account is locked, I'll say that, but... Uh... <laughs> oh, and what I wouldn't give to find that key. <laughs> <laughs> I love snuff. Yeah? Yeah. I, I popped some before. Give me a bit of courage to do this show. <laughs> <laughs> did no, a little James, bit of stuff. No, James, <laughs> you did cocaine. <laughs> The answer is mild, severe, and Armageddon. What <laughs> is the question? Is it? What three options do I give criminals before delivering a good old fashioned pummeling? <laughs> <laughs> You've got to stop doing this. You really, this yeah. vigilante thing has got to end. <laughs> also, you've revealed your secret identity. <laughs> so, I'll, 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 I don't care. Look at my. Get the camera on me. It's me, criminals. I'm the pummeler. <laughs> And you've not even got changed, you've just taken your mask off. So just what yeah. I wear anyway, and then I'll pull the jumper up over my head. <laughs> <laughs> Is it name three words that get progressively harder to spell? <laughs> it's like giving a teenage boy a leaflet on masturbation, you know, they don't want to hear it, they're just going to use it as a tissue. <laughs> <laughs> Depends if, if it's instructions. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a horrible image of you at 14 going... Yip, yip, yip. <laughs> <laughs> and that is why it's called the pummeler. <laughs> <laughs> cool. You with your jumper over your face going to town on yourself. <laughs> what? Take that, criminals! Take that! Yeah. <laughs> That whole region is run by unicorns and leprechauns anyway. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> well, an example that's more far-fetched, and don't do one that we know is kind of basically true. <laughs> You've just tweaked it a little bit. If, if you're a scientist watching a comedian on a science project... <laughs> <laughs> oh, Someone told me that yes. today it is 13 years since the first ever episode of What the Week was yes, filmed. Yes, it is, that's yeah. That is and that is the biggest burn ever on this show. <laughs> I feel, I feel like I've been pummeled. Yes. Uh, <laughs> what yeah. setting do you want, my man? <laughs> <laughs> the answer is 3.4 billion. What is the question? Is Sorry. it... How many pieces of confetti does the average bride inhale on her wedding day? <laughs> <laughs> is it... How many anonymous Father's Day cards did I send my friend Shagger Pete this year? <laughs> How many people across the globe are expected to watch this year's FIFA World Cup tournament in Russia? Have you been watching it? Religiously. OK. I, that's, that's a no. That's a... Well, I'm not religious. OK. <laughs> My name in Icelandic would be Huge Johnson. That's kept me happy for three or four days now, that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that and your big dick. <laughs> Just dreadful at this. No I think we should film this and just put the word Brexit in front of it. <laughs> <laughs> What's the thing you shout, by the way, during the thunderclap? Uh, it's a who. It what does it, does it mean? mean? Something. It literally means nothing. It just means like who. But, yeah. Sounds like a goddamn owl. To wit, to Hugh. There we go. Ah. <laughs> I'm getting that done. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I'm getting it done, but it's going to be my face, so people know it's me from the back. <laughs> that is quite a taunt, yeah. sculpting it, a bald man out it, of it, hair. <laughs> <laughs> Whose job has become available this week? Oh, sorry about this, Dara. We, um, we couldn't think of any other way to do this. <laughs> <laughs> we took a vote, it was unanimous. Hugh led the charge, if I'm honest. <laughs> Was, was there anyone who voted against this, or was it just...? Andy Parsons. <laughs> but... <laughs> we told him you no longer have a say here. Yeah. <laughs> What's going on here? <laughs> uh, this is Labour Life, which is the festival that Labour started up to rival Glastonbury. <laughs> <laughs> Is, is somebody shouting out, 
is that a strongly worded letter to Theresa May in your pocket, or are you just pleased to see me? <laughs> <laughs> I laughed at it about two times on the build-up to that. <laughs> That's why this show is free. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know this show was free. This show here? Yeah. Have you paid to be on it? <laughs> yeah, I pay every week. <laughs> Um, the magic... Sorry, what's the Jeremy Corbyn song? It's um, very annoying, uh... it's oddly tribal, and it puts off any new followers. <laughs> <laughs> Much like the Labour Party. Yeah. <laughs> moving on, what's going on here? <laughs> she looks like she's got a particularly tangy fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, apologies. Apologies. Tangfastic. 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 Are totally not coming to my eighth birthday party. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, you're leaving party. <laughs> 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 she on the burn, Dara. I'm warming my hands on you. You've been burned so bad. Still <laughs> 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 smouldering over here. <laughs> good job, Ellie. <laughs> <laughs> I gave him my death stare. I got a real good death stare. Go on. You're gonna die. <laughs> no, if you have to say you're going to die, <laughs> it's an ineffective death stare. It's like... <laughs> How's this one? I always get worried when Hugh spins around too quickly. Yeah, why? we're going to get a face full of the huge Johnson. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you worry, I've tethered it. <laughs> <laughs> to, to his chair, though, so when he gets up for scenes, it's going to be very... <laughs> What's going on here? It looks like he uh, just accidentally called Theresa May mum. <laughs> <laughs> he was her campaign manager, so he said that if I, I, I made her, I can destroy her. I, That's got... not the whole point of making something, is it? Yeah, it's, well... If you make something, you don't look forward to breaking it. <clears throat> I don't make a cake and go, I can't wait to break that cake. <laughs> <laughs> do you make a cake and, and then leave, leave it, it untouched? Yeah, you, uh, do, yeah. you do break it. Is your house like some weird cereal killer? I can presume it is anyway, James. <laughs> uh, but <laughs> just like loads of cakes under glass domes. Yeah, I'll, and I'll stroke them all before I go and do Mock the Week. <laughs> <laughs> For a little bit of good luck. <laughs> See you later, Cakey. That's one of them. That's only one of their names. I'm not telling you all their names, otherwise you'll have control over them. <laughs> Does it lead to a net, this cannon, or is it like... Poof, Better not land in one of my cakes. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be so angry. If they smash cakey. If I oh, smash yeah. up cakey and Jeremy Hunt's there, <laughs> just sitting in Vicky, she's a Victoria sponge. <laughs> <laughs> now we have two. Keep <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll talking, Dara, we'll get yeah. the best. <laughs> is it the... The dad one, not the it's other the, one. It's the dad, Danny, yeah, rather not the than, one, than the daughter. The other Danny Dyer. Yeah, the daughter Danny... Uh... chaos now with two Danny oh, Dyers. God. It's, just, it's more mm. confusing for me, cos uh, Danny Dyer is the name of a carrot cake I made. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're Danny Dyer. So what's happened to that twat David Cameron who called it on? <laughs> How come he can scuttle off? He called all this on, yeah? Where is he? He's in Europe, in Nice. With his trotters up, yeah. <laughs> Can you scuttle if you got trotters? <laughs> What's going on here? <clears throat> Is someone about to push him through it like Play-Doh? <laughs> <laughs> Why has Corbyn come under pressure this week? He's the leader of the opposition and he's not opposing anything. Is that... <laughs> yeah. The answer is chicken, <clears throat> beer and crumpets. What is the question? Is it, in my song about my favourite things, what line comes after Dickens, Deers and drum kits? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Is it, what is the password to my new secret chicken, beer and crumpets club? <laughs> <laughs> In uh, Asda online, you can, they're rationing the amount of Coke and Pepsi you can buy to six massive bottles. <laughs> <laughs> serious, Hugh. How, how am I meant to have a fizzy bath? <laughs> <laughs> I, I found a way around the fizzy drinks thing. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Nando's do bottomless soft drinks. <laughs> <laughs> You've solved that one, haven't you? For the price of one, I got it forever. <laughs> yes, but I'm... <laughs> See this guy who got a tattoo of saying England World Cup winners 2018 tattooed on his belly. Yeah. Oh, there he is. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah he, he looks exactly like I that... imagined. <laughs> <laughs> I, 
I love it. I've been wearing my shades. Wearing my shades, and I, I become a different person when I've got my shades on. Called Cool James. <laughs> <laughs> cool James is like, would you like to meet him? I, I'm excited now, yes. I thought Cool James was the name of your Eccles cakes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no way. Cool. Really cool. Hey, cool. I don't know who this pretty cool guy is, but welcome to Mock the Week. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> okay, cool, James. Uh, <laughs> how does cool James feel about continuity within a television program? <laughs> hey, you tell all those editors in your ear. <laughs> <laughs> Edit in a show down. Not cool. <laughs> Gone. He's gone. 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 Where's he gone? He's gone. He, he went away. <laughs> 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 and that's the end of the show. This week's winners are James A. Carter, Hugh Dennis, and Angela Barnes. <laughs> James A. Carter, Hugh Dennis, and Tom Allen. <laughs> this week's winners are James A. Carter, Hugh Dennis, and Tom Allen.